So, we have bought a lot. Yeah, so we've got to ask Chris, haven't we? Yeah, we just, we just went straight arms. How much do you want for all of it? And we're going to now split it. A bit of a backstory. It's from the, the same lady we got the trainers off. Um, a lot more clothes this time, but just it looks like more stuff than last time, to be fair. So we're going to tackle this now. Split it in half. Take it home. Yeah, there's some, there's some quality stuff in there. I'm gonna put them like in there, yeah. I don't think um, it's a tech fleece, though. Yeah. Tech fleeces are expensive. Rab, good stuff. Jules coats. Ralph Lauren North Face. What have we got here? Yeah. Barts. Don't know what Barts is. Cavu. Nike tech fleece. Quite a few Nike tech fleeces. Ooh, so, it. yeah, we've kind of sorted it and now we've just got to kind of pick it. So we got Ugg bags, Nike, Ralph Lauren, a lot of North Face, a lot of North Face. Cookie? Oh, you like that? that <laughs> so you're just splitting it down the middle? Yeah. Favela. There's a couple pair of Kurt Geiger, so I'll just put them down there for now. Okay. They're just reacts, I think. Yeah, the Clarks each. Clarks each, yeah. What else? Anything else similar? Uh, yeah, there's a few Birkenstocks and a few yeah. North Faces and stuff. See where we're at. Two S's, so we'll do a pair of S's. A pair of S's. Clarks again. Yep. Clarks. Clarks. Clarks again. So they are just splitting it down the middle, really? Yeah, we're not even looking at it, really. There's no point, I don't think, because if you're going to do that, then we'll have to like, start looking stuff up. And yeah, exactly. Face, North Face, North okay. Face. Two pair of Kurt Geigers. So, where was that Kurt Geiger? At the bottom. I've still got a clarks here, so have we got another clarks? Yeah, somewhere, yeah. yeah. Figure it out in a minute. Oh, there you are. Whichever one you want of them. Yeah. Carvellas or. Big one this time. Yep. Yeah. Um, Birkin Birkin stocks. Stocks, yeah. yeah. A bit crushing them ones, but whichever one. Bigger ones again. One. Yep. Um, I'll take the Nikes if you okay. want. You take whatever you want now. Mm -hmm. know, any choice. Oh, a little look see. Some of these down here as well, I'm not sure, but they're pretty funky. Cut, Kurt Geiger's, June, the pair of hooks. Do you want the other pair of hooks? I'll take the North Face for, you, for your Nikes. Yep. Yeah. Uh, there's two of these, so do you yeah, want one of those? Let's put them one and a half, yep. Yeah. So we can want Japanese brand there. Yeah. Knowledge. Yeah. yeah, yeah, so there's a blue and I think you want there, so. How many have you got there then? There's, there's them ones there. Yeah. So what do you want one of them? Because they're the same style okay. or whatever. Yeah. Which one? I'll take that, that one. one. Got a. That blue one there or this one? Zip up. Are they both new attacks? This is a women's XL, yeah, both new attacks. They're both North Face. That's a North they? Face like thin shell. I think there's a couple of them actually, so. Okay. Very similar, so. Two one each, yeah. There. So I think they're both the same, both with tags. So, whatever okay. you want. Do you want the beige one or the green one? I'll take the beige one. Yeah. Do you want a black tech fleece or a grey tech fleece? They both sell really well, so. Grey. Grey, yeah. Right. One of them each. Do you want the ACG one? Yeah. Yeah, sweet. Uh, the green one of them and a Green one of them, they go crew necks. Yeah, I've got a green one this time. ACG and a Jordan. You choose. I quite like the ACG. Okay. I'll but they're probably one. worth probably the about same amount. Yeah. Um, I'll take the North if you want both of them. Yeah. We're getting into it now. Yeah, we're getting there, right? Should we do the coats? Yeah. So we've got Buffalo. What we've got? We've got that Ralph. Yeah. We've got a Ralph each, but I, is this one being used? So it's just, no, it's got both. So both tags. So that's purple and then double sided. So, one of them each. It doesn't matter to me. The double side is probably better, but you can have it if you want. Cool. Yeah, yeah. Right, I really do want these trousers because I might keep them. So, right. they're, they're just urban outfitters. Right. So, we'll just take them little, little piece there. Like you grab a piece. Sorry, I got a mug. Fine. Yeah, yeah. Cool. So, we've, um, we've come to some sort of agreement. We've just been absolutely bombarding through it. <laughs> so, we've got a ton of trainers and shoes each. Chris's are over there. It's a pair of y frees each, pair of Uggs each. No, I just have a little nap. Charlotte's mm -hmm. having a nap. Um, there's all sorts of puffer coats, little doggies knocking about, and um, yeah, we, we had a good time though. Yeah. yeah. I think that was easier coming here, wasn't it? We flashed. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Instead of being like, oh, yeah, searching it up. Do you know what I mean? It was just Not way like easier. In the house, is it? Yeah. We have done it fairly. It's been one. Yeah, it's been it's been sweet as anything. So we've got a load of clothes each, loads of shoes each, and um, we just need to take a dinosaur each now, sure. <laughs> <laughs> we'll go with the green. <laughs> been a pleasure Chris. Yeah, nice one mate. Yeah, enjoy the nice football deal. today. City tonight. Fingers crossed eh? Yeah, so um, yeah. Catch you in a bit. So, we've done it Chris's. We've got an absolutely car full of stuff. So, we'll get back home. Uh, maybe not today. 
But tomorrow we'll catch up with you and we'll show you what we got because we've got an absolute ton. So me and Shah, we're just going to fly through everything. We're going to do our big haul. We're going to go through each piece yep. as best we can. And um, yeah, just show you what we've got. It's going to be exciting. It's organised chaos. Okay. Blum, blum, blum. So it's going to be a mega haul. It's going to be mega? Mega. So between me and Chris, we spent 2200 so we went half at so £1,100 each. So we spent a lot. Anyway, there's a range of coats, tops. You would have seen a little bit in the GoPro footage. Um, so yeah, we're just going to fly through it. So over on Chris's channel, it will be linked down below. He's got his side of the haul as well. So you'll be able to see exactly the total what we bought and yeah. kind of see what he got after what you split it directly down the middle we took it back to chris's house and we yeah did. we did you pick one i choose one kind of broke it down like clark's clark's you would have seen a little bit on the footage yeah. all based but, um, on price point and yeah brand. yeah Pr brand's price point was just going halves and um yeah there's loads of profit to be made as you said like two brothers sharing gifts on christmas day <laughs> yeah it felt like christmas day yeah it did new bro you know look at that oh, eyes a beauty aztec pastel fleecy that's gorgeous fp movement is the brand FP movement, FP All movement, tags. size XL, XL women's mainly, and it retailed at $168 at. Okay. And this one, I didn't really take notice of when we was going through it, but it seems to be like a pretty nice, nice little jacket. North Face, Nupsy, Gillet, XL women's again, with tags, purple, 1996 retro Nupsy, it's called. Nike ACG, quarter zip, half zip, it's a beauty. Retailed at £189, that one in good hood london very nice but that is nice that, that is real real nice and again they'll sell year round those that is a beauty i love it this one is a denim and supply ralph lauren Ooh. beautiful little patch on the side there these retail for quite a lot as well 305 pounds on that one that was straight from ralph lauren it's a size xl not sure if that's an xl women or not but it's tent green called a dnf down snorkel khaki so the rolling total so far is about £700. Bit of a standard one, this. It is a mountain warehouse jacket. Brand new with tags again, though. So I'm not sure on the going rate of these, but they're at least like 40 They're about £39.99. Yeah, mountain warehouse. Bosh. It's actually £119.99 on that. Oh, it's a proper outdoor one, then. Yeah, £119.99. It's not like a Caramore job. It's a proper double fleece oh, line one. Proper, proper Got a, one. a zip fleece inside, so... Nice. That is a size 18 women's. So really good sizes for reselling all of this. My favourite brand to sell. This is a nice long line ass and wenger puffer. Ooh, number of steps. Um, 169 pounds retail for. So again, good good money. Um, that's a UK 20. I've been sending out a lot of size 20 stuff at the moment. I list it for a day and it goes, doesn't it? Yeah, really quick turnover on the bigger size. So do this. Like air flight bomber, like I used to have a khaki bomber like this back in the day with an orange inner that was well, man. That went it inner, um, and that's an XL women's again, brand new with tags. It's a beaut that, uh, there's no price, there's no price on there, but I reckon that would have retailed for about 100 pound, yeah, yeah, new with tags again. It's nice, kind of like an Alpha Industries kind of vibe. I um, love the orange lining, yeah, yeah. Well, I think Alpha have that as well, so it's actually got the night tick in the back there. Is it reversible? Maybe. I love orange, don't I? Maybe. So anything orange is going on. That looks nice. Do you know what? Even with your hoodie on, that fits well. So that's just got a little night tick there. And you've got a back that's piece nice. there. So that's nice. little reversible. It might be worth a little bit more than a 40, but it's a little reversible number. Yeah. But um, again... We're already up to 1100 so we've Yeah, and like retail, retail value, yeah. Retail value on the seven items so far. Got our spend back. It's nice. I do love that. If anything takes your eye on the video, let me know. So we'll be able to sort some out. This next one is a rab. So I've recently sold a men's rab jacket, R-A-B, for 75. This one is a women's. It's used. She's used this a little bit. So it's not brand new with tags. And it's a UK 16, that one. Purple puffer. It's really nice. It'll probably fit me really well, to be fair. So I might have to... Well, if it's got no tags on, you could even keep that for yourself. You could yeah. do with a new might, be, it might possibly be a little key Get it that. on. So I'll try it on. Yeah, we know you want the tea. Come on! Oh, okay. That's nice. Oh. That's a keeper for you. Oh. The other one's got a hole in. Oh. Oh. Sorry. I, I'm going to keep it. Yeah. I'm going to keep it. That is beaut. Really. Oh, look at that downing. Oh, it's feathered at all, man. You know what they like. 
So when me and John argue, he can use that as a duvet, can't we? That's nice. Fits you really well. That is nice. And you got like when I say used as well, like she's used it a couple of times. Once it's, twice. You know what I mean? It's she has a she had a big big collection of clothes, new and used. So when she does use stuff, it's few and far between. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? And this is a thick hoodie you've got on, so it fits really well. Yeah, for it's, a woman. it's nice. And like can, proper feel that. Can I? Just do you mean when you buy a North Face Nupsy or something? Inside. Yeah, yeah, it's proper. Oh, what's this? Bag it'll, to put it'll it'll in. Like, it's a bag. <sighs> yeah, a bag to put it in, which is handy Smart. for travel. Anyway, that's worth eleven hundred quid to me. That. That, just this one coat mm -hmm. like we've been saying for ages he's got a puffer with a hole and his other one's a bit well worn so yeah. you need a but yeah i appreciate <laughs> nice little coat from the hall that's my little takings from it what am i gonna take next up we've got a nice long line arca by john lewis it's kin so we've actually got a little uh kin jumper listed at the minute and it was 129 pound brand new that one size xl it's a khaki long line coat Never been out of the bag. I think there was three of them. I think Chris ended up with two of these. And we've got one. Beauty. Gorgeous. And the good thing about these coats, they're not, they're actually year round coats because a lot of them are waterproof sporting. <laughs> you dumbo. You know, I said Arca, right? I said Arca because it says Arca there, but it's because the P's up there. So I'm like, yeah, it's an Arca that. It's a Parker, all right? I was thinking, what the hell's an Arca? But I thought it might I be a new thing coming in, do you know what I mean? I didn't even register. <laughs> it is a Parker. Well done for um, yourself. <laughs> but yeah, lightweight, so it still move all year round. Oh you my days. Oh my days. I think days. it should be a thumbnail picture. Oh my days. It is a reversible polo sport puffer. That Brand new with tags. It looks expensive in real life, like the thickness of it. Size XL, I think XL women's are going or XL men's. I'm not sure how it, how it works. Spending. Anyway. Brand new with tags. Retails at about 350, 400. Right. Um, so that's the other side. You've got the blue, green, and the white. Totally reversible. Yeah, as Chaddy Pete would say, I know. that is a beaut. You see, I'd keep that as well, but you know, we don't need loads now, do we? We yeah, need we, money we, for we, holidays. We have got to make some money back, so. <laughs> right, so we did spend 1100 each, me and Chris. But the lady at the end, she said, I've got these Pradas. If you want them, they're 50 quid. I mean, just we took them, didn't we? Yeah. Um, it's car shoe for Prada. So she had them imported from Italy. Yeah, very cool. They're a size 38, so they're a UK 5. Mm -hmm. They are my mum's size. I don't think my mum would like them, though. She'd like them if they didn't have the stud. <laughs> Got the bag in there, everything like that. They've never been worn. I can't find much on them, if I'm being honest. Um, so it's going to take a little bit more research. But I think my 50 quid's safe. Yeah. Defo. So 11 items is the rolling total, and we're at 1850 about the ad of the Pradas, as we don't really know their worth. Next up for the hoodlum out there, we've got some <laughs> Nike Tech fleeces. So that's a black one. Um, it's women's XL again. There's also a green one in there, brand new with tags as well. That's an XL women's again. I think Chris got the grey one, the classic grey one. Uh -huh. And then this one, I'm not sure if it's a Tech fleece or not, but it's a France football one so i did see the joggers online i was doing a bit of search on these but again xl women's it's got kind of got this back thing on the go but um probably similar similar retail but yeah brand new tags again love that pink tick yeah it's uh france football federation yeah. yo all right okay oh, all right okay dj mashup no nah, no nah, don't 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 don't, don't. <laughs> Right, next up, we've got some Mavpan specials. We've got a couple of Apple Watch bands. These ones in particular, I have asked the uh, queen of Apple Watch bands. She said they're at least £35 each. Got these regular little M&S loafers. leather shoes, loafers, and uh, they retailed at £45. Obviously, we won't be able to sell them for that. Still like 30 quid though, probably. Yeah. It's brand new. So, a pair of Nike Reacts. These are the only pair of Nikes we got this time. Nike React Element 55. Got some Birkenstocks, regular ones. Well, they'll be lovely for summer coming up. Ba, ba, da, ba, ba. They won't stick about. Pair of Hunter Wellies. They are burgundy. They're about 120 brand new, I think, aren't they? I'm not sure. You're the expert. Pair of Y3s. Adidas Y3s. Y3 Kanja. Never heard of them. Never heard of Y3. No. I'm not I'm not hot on trainers. It's not my thing. Y3 bag. Obviously, they're brand new. We, don't actually, we haven't actually seen what a lot of those shoes look like. So it's a surprise for us as much as you. So obviously, they're, they're, you know, they're not everyone's cup of tea. No. So we just did brand for brand. Like, yeah. there was two pair of Y3s. So Chris grabbed the box. We grabbed the box. We didn't have to look inside and, and say, oh, these are worth 180. These are worth 160. Do you know what I mean? We just kind of did it. 
we didn't have time for that. We didn't have time for that, do you know what I mean? We could have done it for that and it we would have been even, there all day. It evens itself out. Yeah, yeah. And they wanted to watch the City match. <laughs> Got a pair of these last time. It's the Suiko one. I think it's a Japanese brand that do sandals. Sold the last pair for £70, I think, or £60. I think they're cool. I'd love a pair of them. So, Vagabond. Never heard of the brand. What are we going to get? Ooh, smart. Never heard of the brand. They're like cowboy bros. They look well made. They look well, well made. They're very really nice. We're not going to search up and see how much they're worth right now because we just don't have the time. But they look, they look the real deal. Pair of merry people. Because we are merry, merry people. We're saying merry and you're merry, like, merry, 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 merry. Just wanted to give you a big thank you for purchasing and supporting us at Merry People. Very merry, very merry. Um, oh, cool, they're smart. I really like them. That green and blue yeah, together. Yeah, proper my mum vibes these. Black hair and... Navy and olive. Size six, so they're too big for my mother. All right. Not too big for me. Tiring, I'm lugging all the trainers about. So leave a like for the effort. Leave a like, <laughs> yeah. Leave a nice comment. These are Nordicas. So Nordish brand, I'm guessing. Swedish, something like that. Blue and yellow. Very funky. No, they're cool. Kind of like a blue zebra. Reminds me of like a Call of Duty camel, that. The guys watching this will know what I mean when they say it looks like Blue Tiger. Blue Tiger off. Modern Warfare 2, Modern Warfare 3, something like that. Blue Tiger. I say Blue Tiger once more. Blue Tiger. 49 euros they uh, retail for. A pair of Clarks. There's a load of Clarks in here, to be fair. They are like suede ankle boots. Chelsea boots, yeah. Yep, yeah. Sebago, yeah. never heard of that. They look just like Clark's Wallabies, though. Very similar. Like I said, we don't have time to search everything up now. And ponder on it, you get to look what they are in their name. <laughs> yeah. There's so much to get through, bags and bags of clothes, so. A pair of Berties, looks like a pretty nice brand. Ankle boot, suede, brown suede. Birdie. Birdie, get your shoes. That is Sea Salt Cornwall Blackfish Brogues. They just use a plain white box, but they're really nice. Fred Perry. Good catch. catch. Good catch. Sorry. Just shiny little shoes. Kurt Geiger London. I really like them. I may want them for holiday. They're very nice. Well, you paid 200 so that's half your money there. <laughs> Panama Jack. Panama was that, Jack. Was that loud enough? Panama Spanish brands. Spanier. I gave my mother the last pair of Panama Jacks. These aren't a five. Ooh, These are a bit of meat them. Pair of Teva. T E V A. They are sandals. Nice little pattern. I do like the pattern to be fair. Now they're special. Aren't they? So they're very furry, very ugly. I'm not a fan, but you know, each of their own, do you know what I mean? Make sure you're <sighs> leaving a nice like and comment and share because he's putting graft for this. It's hard work. It is hard work. He's lifting. Paraclax. Pretty cool. Another Paraclax. It's got the receipt in there and it was £69. She got a 20% discount, so it worked out at £55.25. She bought a carry bag for 5p. 2017. Six year old. There you go. £69. They are. A little bit higher than ankle, aren't they? Yeah, like they shin are. high, like navy blue. Suede, suede. Really smart. Another pair of Uggs. What's in this one? Oh, I've already seen. I always see the picture at the side before you get to it. Have you? Yeah, you, I keep seeing it because I'm on the side. Is I it nice? The are they nice? Yeah, they look quite nice. Lace ones again. A booty, but almost like a... Um... Yeah, they're like regular Uggs, aren't they? Yeah. Just with laces on. Elia B. London. Never heard of her. Nope. Very Doc Martinet. Yeah, Westworld. The... These are Geox. Again, very similar ankle boot. They're very... I, I never suit anything like this, like me personally. Yeah. But I do like the orange and the grey together. Nora Face. Gore-Tex boots. Proper I like, them. I like the pink. Proper them. Where's the pink? The little bit on the back. And the logo. Oh, yeah. And the laces down the front, there's pink in it. Very nice. It's really good colour. So they're Gore-Tex, Vibram, all of that good stuff. June Black. Very premium. Isn't June a shoe shop? Yeah. Yeah. So they, they're they like platform. They're about to say they're platform. Suede ankle boots again. Fur lined. Really nice, different fur. Comfy, comfy. Lining there. 164 Parlour is the uh, name. Du -du 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 -du. Dr. Martin. They're all tissued up, so these are sexy, these. These are nice. 
they like platform Doc Martin sandals. Like these are real nice, real, real nice. Because like even the bu buckles all black, it's all blacked out. They've got to be worth a few bob though. They are really nice. Clarkies again, another ankle boot, white leather. Clarkies again. Oh, Charlotte, Charlotte, Charlotte. Look at these wallabies, man. <laughs> They're cool. Look at these wallabies. They're really cool. Didn't realise what this box was before. Just an S on it, but it's Clark's again. Bougie Clark's. Like a weird leather kind of trainer with like suede. Very uh, complex and modern. Yeah, really modern design. Yeah. Last but not least for the trainers and shoes and boxes. Another pair of Clark's. Ankle boot again. She loved an ankle boot. She did. So that's all the trainers. Uh, now there's just bags and bags and bags. Of clothes right so all clothes left now the uh the next bag we've put all the brand new and sealed stuff together a lot of it has got tags but these are the ones that are in sealed bags so we've got this next nighty their dreamline it was 25 pounds that is extra large one we've got these cord dungarees these are lucy and yak mm -hmm. organic cotton really nice really popular. brand new in the bag these would be like an xl one and something like that easy 50 quid lovely lime green like pastel green really um awesome. crew neck jumper Women's XL. Got a jewel zip up. That retailed at forty nine ninety five. Got the, like the classic stripes on there. Jewels, they love that, don't they? Pressing stripes. Mm -hmm. Some North Face shorts. These big North Face fleece jackets. The actual name of them is Mashup Coat Aviator Navy. Um, the mashup the mashup the North Face. Oh yeah, so that's XL Women's again, that's a navy one. That is a tie-dye Jordan hoodie, XL Women's again. Very nice. We've got some Nike joggers there, XL Women's again. Or oh, Women's Large, actually. And they're like fleecy, like the fleecy feel. Oh, they look gorgeous. Not for you, John. Maybe, because they're not XL, they're large, they might fit them. Not Parisi. Not Parisi. Not Parisi. Um, this is a soft cotton one, so it's not like a waterproof one. But um, Blue Marine. Beautiful, that's a double XL. Not sure if that's women's or men's. But obviously, it's the Harland Norway flag. Harland, Harland, sexy body. Another one of those North Face ones, a little bit different. I think it's like a, a little quarter button up one. Very nice. Baby blue, little Tommy Jeans navy hoodie. Nothing special, that one. Um, 3XL. And then, last little brand new and sealed piece is this Cavu fuzz, kind of like a fur backpack. And they retail for about $60, so nice. Next up, North Face Joggers, brand new with tags. Crew clothing, little thin, very thin jumper. Great colours for the time of year. We've ended up with lots of pastels and... Yeah, this one's nice. This is a Gantt. Really nice. Very thin jumper, or you'd say it could be a long sleeve t-shirt. It's that thing, but uh, nice spell out. Got this cactus, cactus print blouse next. Retail at 25, 24. Yeah. Nice. Easy 18 pounds. There's some low end stuff as well. So we've got some MS chinos. Then again, they retail at 25 pounds. So still, well, MS stuff. is still high street. I love these. These are amazing. They don't fit me. Um, 55 pounds these rates are that. It's a BDG Urban Outfitters, like fleecy joggers. I love them. I do love them. I wouldn't wear them out. out. I'd probably wear them to the shops, pair of Crocs on. Do you know what I mean? Chilling, sage green Crocs. Do you know what I mean? You're right, yawning over there. You okay. I'm really flagging. <laughs> Two dungarees. And a really nice fleece sweatshirt. Yeah. Brand new Ooh, Nike that fleecy weezy. That is a full zip, half zip. That is a half zip. Brand new with tags, XL Women's again. Love that. North Face full zip, that one. With a nice pattern across the front. That's XL Women's again, I think. Yep. That's cool. They'll, mm. they'll retail for quite a good amount. Polar Bear pajamas, new with tags. From MS. MS with love. Peruna cargos, they retail at £35. And at that size, the UK 20, they do hold their value, so it's an easy 20 to 25. M&S cardigan, new with tags. There is this M&S wool kind of uh, vest. It's a long line jump. <sighs> Jesus Christ, we just I'm got... I'm like, all shaken up. We just got interrupted by that emergency alert. Sunday, bloody three o'clock. It didn't catch it on um, film, but yeah. I covered my ears. I went, John, help! Yeah, the, the, video, the video just stopped. As soon as that alert went off, the video stopped filming. You were so cute with me then, though. You like held me and went, it's all right. No, it's, I just said it's that thing. <sighs> but that's what would happen if there was like an imminent nuclear strike. So hopefully we don't hear that again. Anytime soon, anyway. <sighs> Couple of shirts there, very soft. They're just um, flannel shirts. M&S, retail at twenty seven fifty. so still... Good value. Little two furry backpack, eighteen pounds. And two holds its value brilliantly. That doesn't stick around. She did have about four or five furry backpacks. She was a furry backpack fan. I'm really sad. Chris got 
a nug fleecy one and yeah the and old backpack and when you gave it to me i felt like saying i really wanted that one but i didn't want to be difficult yeah, sorry tie-dye ralph Lauren hoodie brand new with tags little ralph wool quarters it brand new with tags again really nice purple oh, a little, nice little bit that. of purple but it's not you. can't wait to wear my purple coat nice really nice uh brand new nike shorts peruna cords brand new hold their value again size 20 39.50 they went for we'll get around 30 for that big mns like Furry, sheep skinny type. Shirling, almost. Yeah, beautiful. Big pullover. Retail about £89. Yeah. Another UK 20. M&S sleeveless cardi. M&S blue cargos. They are M&S jeans, but they're the magic jeans. So anything when it has, like I've said before, when it has a bright name, like magic jeans, the Stephanie jeans. Yeah, you get good money. About 20, so, M&S magic jeans. M&S cargos again. I mean, the cargos for our mum's age group will look really smart. Do you know what yeah, I mean? they're good. They're trendy. These again are these Peruna cargos, but again, the uh, thirty-five pound, a lot of money. Peruna's a premium high street. What is that, Yeah, that's what I mean. I didn't even realise. Did you realise? Yeah, Peruna is Eminem. Little North Face Mac, brand new with tags again. Another Magic Jeans. Magic Jeans again from Eminem. Thirty-five pound. They retail that. Last but not least. We have got some beautiful M&S tapered high-rise, short M&S collection, size 16, thin cargoes. I am so happy to be finished with that haul because that is mad. I've got to move it all again now. Can you, show, you can need to show them it. This is um, kind of, it kind of all fell on Charlotte mid-recording. Um, <laughs> we're trapped in. Yeah, we're, it's just all going to go back down over there, but bloody hell. From the people's house to Chris's house, Chris's house to our house, yeah. our house to the garage, and then the garage... Around the garage, in and out, shake it all about. And John Luke has done it all, so he's worked hard. Yeah. Whoo! So. So. We'll keep you updated how the sales go. Maybe yeah. Do a little um, recap video. Yeah, yeah. Well, just tune into the videos as well, and I'll check on Miss Charlotte, see what's been selling on her side. Um, if you are new to the channel, you know, pop in on all the videos. You do see sales. You do see me picking up stuff and buying stuff. You see all of it. So if some people might only watch my car boot videos, but if they watch my day in the life as well, they'll kind of see what actually happens to that car boot stuff. So all it's the, the process. Extra, little, all the process. Yeah, it's the process of like, oh, we've been to the car boot. What happens now? Do you know what yeah. I mean? So you kind of see what sells, you know, what doesn't sell, all the ups and downs. and um, How we yeah. deal with what we've got. <laughs> yeah. So if you did enjoy today's video, leave a like, leave a subscribe if you haven't already. Leave a nice comment if you did enjoy the video. There's links down below to our Instagram pages, our eBay stores, all that good stuff. Uh, so yeah, check out all the links down below. And um, yeah, we'll see you in the next one. Bye.